I'm up here. Nod your head if you can hear me. Your head's too small. Wave your arms. That's not your death rose, is it? Oh, good. Welcome to the Amazon. Isn't it great? The only... I don't want to alarm you. There's been a slight scaling error. You've gone fairly small, I won't lie. But I'm going to keep hitting Control z Just bear with me. Bear with me. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa there. Okay. Closer to nature. Right. Very good. To be fair, it is pretty amazing down here, don't you think? She's very good at this. I've been indoors too long. Can't wait for you to meet her. Oh, I wouldn't step on that. The professor must have dropped it. Looks like it might be a message. Well, I'll guess. Mess. I wonder how you play it. Any ideas? Tastes all right, actually. Oh, look who it is. I knew this was a big step coming down here. And right down inside nature. I mean, I knew... No, I, I, I didn't know anything. I, mean, I had no idea how amazing it would feel. I mean, not the first idea. I've never felt more alive. Come on. Come on. What's she doing? Come She's on. saying, come, on. come and eat me. I mean, I had to start here. This is the first bit of nature that blew my mind when I was a kid. You know, I used to think that animals are smarter than plants, but... How wrong can you be? Come on. Oh, here he is. Oh, look at you. Next stop, giant Amazon water lily. OK, it's a journal file. Amazing and fun facts in easy digestible chunks. <clears throat> Sorry, repeating on me a bit, that one. Don't know why she left it out here. Never mind. I suppose we better find out what went wrong with her foolproof plan to fly around the Amazon on an insect. We'll need this. You take it. Wave it about. It's got starch. They love carbs. Now all we have to do is be patient and wait until... Oh, look out! Try feeding him. He's a beetle. Perfectly harmless. There you go, Bertie. Give him a pat on the head and he might let you climb on. See, he likes it. He likes you. Anytime you feel like giving me a pat, feel free. Now climb up. Blimey, there's another journal file. It must be deliberate. She's leaving a trail for us. Ow. You treat your toaster like that? I used to think flowers just stood around waiting to be pollinated, but no way. That lily does all the work. She reaches out to make this happen. And this pineapple smell, that's her. She's drawing us in like a magnet. She's the boss. Hold tight. Bertie's caught the scent. We're off. Good thing you're not afraid of heights. If you do fall off, you won't be scared. Grab the pollen. Get as much as you can. It's all about the pollen. Stack up that pollen count. <sighs> Mind your head! And 
unbelievable. You didn't miss a single one. You must have done this before. Are you a plant? I think that might be our lily. All the way down there. She's absolutely gigantic. Incredibly beautiful. I really must get out more. I'm missing out. I can't see any sign of the professor. I don't know what I'd do if anything happened to her. She made me. Don't get me wrong, I'd be very sad if anything happened to you. Just wouldn't, you know, I wouldn't. I'd get over it, is the point. They must be here for the starch. Getting a little bit lively in here. This part's more for the bug people. Bear with us. Oh, what's happening? It's a trap, I knew it. We're gonna get digested. There's gonna be acid. Meanwhile, everyone's busy stuffing their faces. It's not ideal. Journal file. This had better be good news. Oh, it's getting steamy in here. She's she's closing up to protect her beetles from predators and from getting dehydrated from the heat. And to make sure that she gets that pollen. And it's working. Pollen is turning this female flower into a male. White for girls and pink for boys. <gasps> what a night! By morning, the beetles will be covered with male pollen and then off to the next. Are we going to be stuck in here all night? It's too much. It's, it's, it's everything I hoped for. It's, I just need a moment. I think we all do. Well, not Bertie. Wow, doesn't time fly when you're trapped inside a flower? Feels like we just got here. He's saying goodbye. Give him a pat. He's off to the next party. Insects and flowers. What a team. Do you think one day me and you could be as... What's that noise? Sounds like water. Bit concerning. We're sinking. She didn't say anything about this. There's another journal file. Grab it. Grab it. And it's done. The flower dies back as it sets its seed and sinks to the bottom of the pool. What a way to go. I'd better catch the last beetle out of here. Now she tells us. Percy, come back. You missed a bit. I've got to say I'm envious. Go on, do that thing you do when you're in trouble. You know when all your memories flash before your eyes. I'd love to be able to do that. What's that noise? Is that a death rattle of some kind? Strangely familiar. Back and we're full size. This is the lab. We're going to need this up and running so we can find the professor. First things first, do you know how to move about? Push forward on either of your joysticks to pick where you want to go and release to move. You can also rotate using the joystick. Just push it left or right. Very handy, that. Now, nip over to this button. Hit the button for the first two batteries. Grab a battery and shove it in. Beautiful. 
beautiful. And again. Good job. Last two were over here. Ah, oh, that wasn't supposed to happen. Did I tell you about that special glove power you have? Reach out, hold the trigger and point and pull the controller towards you. Well done. Slightly tricky move, that one. Get it in. Last one. Point and pull and ram it home. How long have I been offline? Who's this? What are you doing bringing an inexperienced candidate into the lab without permission? I don't know what you were thinking. The professor authorised me? It's an emergency. Penny, may I introduce... Sorry, what did you say your name was? Over here, please. Go on. It's quicker if you just do what she says. I'll be supervising your induction from now on. Penny stands for Pro-Environment Non-Native Interface. Cat person. She thinks she's the boss. We need to talk about the professor. Hazzy, it's time for your nap. What? Activating I'm sleep mode in time. five, four. Deactivate assistant designation, Hazzy. Hmm. Much better. Penny doesn't stand for anything. The professor called him Hazzy after the hazard lights on her scooter. Use the button on the desk to upload the journal files. I'll find the professor. This is the review screen. It shows the data you collected out in the field. For each journal file you found, you are awarded a nature point. Here you can see a summary of your previous Biorb adventure and key data facts you recorded along the way. You're welcome. That's odd. It's saying there's hidden information in the... to believe I was ever inside a flower. I don't like being big. Why should we walk all over nature? It should be the other way round. The flower should be able to hold us. She should be the boss. And if we get out of line... Oh no, don't look at that. That's a malfunction. You do not have clearance to view her diaries. I don't know what that was. It must have been a glitch. Forget you saw that. Right, well, let's get you back out into the field. I've had enough of all this. We need to find more data so that we can locate the Professor. Remember her? Here, take this watch and scanner. Use the scanner to perform a test scan on this plant. That's not a suggestion, it's an instruction. Point your scanner at the plant and press and hold the trigger on your controller until the scan is complete. Well done. Seems you've got the hang of it. Now you can see important information about the item you scanned and where it falls within its ecosystem. Press your watch to see your progress. Every plant or animal you're able to find and scan belongs to an ecoset. And if you scan every item in an ecoset, you'll be awarded a nature point. Isn't that exciting? But they're not just treats. Nature points are how I assess your abilities. When you're ready, press your watch again to close the panel. Right then, it's time to get going. This teleportation pad will take you back to the Amazon, this time at normal size. We need more data before you attempt another biorb. Shrinking is dangerous. Hazzy means well, but he's not the sharpest tool. I, however, am. Activate and set the destination of the teleportation pad by pressing the Amazon button over here. Enter the teleport. It's perfectly safe. Remember, you're going to scan and only to scan and come straight back. No one likes being eaten. It's very inconvenient for everyone. Where am I? Oh, hello. My sat-nav says we're back in the Amazon. Look, another biorb. Says it needs five nature points to open it. You only have four. It must be one for each of those journal files we found earlier with Bertie. 
how can we get that extra nature point? Let me think. I mean, feel free to think also. I don't, I don't want to force you out of a habit. Wait, is that a scanner on your tool belt? If you scan the plants and animals around here, then you can complete an eco-set, and that'll give you another nature point. I'm a genius. You've got it. Now point your scanner at this plant and hold the trigger until it's fully scanned. Can't do anything with half a scan, so keep it pressed until it completes. Why don't you scan this one, just to start you off? Well done, your first eco-set. That's enough points to unlock this bi-orb. Now, Penny says we shouldn't go through to find the Professor because it's dangerous and you're not experienced enough. But, let's just say if we were going to go through, you just approach the bi-orb holder and press the button, if you were. Not saying we are. If. Very good. That is exactly what you do in a live situation. I'm sure you remember the next step. You pick it up and stick your face in it, so if we... 